Good afternoon, YouTubers. How you guys doing today? Rob AZ here. You know what? I was thinking that I should get out a little bit more in the daylight and do some vlogs, you know? Just so I'm not cooped up up in my uh, man cave, you know? It gets kind of boring. So I thought I'd come out. Just got out of the gym right now, so... Whew. So, uh... I'm going to be doing another review here once I get home and uh, get ready and get get this gym funk off me. So, I will be back in a few. And like I said, I always appreciate you guys. My subscribers, my soon-to-be subscribers, or just a casual viewer of my channel. So, I will be back in a bit, and I'll see you then. Well, I'm back, guys. Alrighty, so I guess I'm ready to do a review and today I'm pretty excited about this one I don't know why but uh, it's it, it seems really appealing to me. So today We will be reviewing the Quaker Chewy Girl Scouts Thin Mints granola bars For some reason a granola bar plus a Girl Scout Thin Mint is an A plus. I cannot see how I could not like this. So let's go ahead and dig into these. All right. So it says eight grams of whole grains, no high fructose corn syrup, which is a plus. I mean, you gotta admit that's a plus. Um, 100 calories per bar, one gram of saturated fat, 70 milligrams of sodium, and eight grams of sugar. So I mean, still not all that great, you know. It's it's not it's not a healthy option. So, all right. It says, "Be the role model she'll always remember." Volunteer today at GirlScouts.org/volunteer. Girl Scouts. Okay, it says open here. That's what it looks. This is what it looks like again. All right. Yeah. I was thinking, as you see, as you saw in the intro, you know, I'm gonna try to get out a little bit more. Try to, you know, do some walks and neighborhood stuff, you know. I mean, I go to the gym pretty not every day, probably like five days a week, but uh, you know, get some uh, Arizona scenery, you know. Here in Arizona, it's always sunny, so you might as well enjoy it, right? So let's go ahead and look at these. So this is what it looks like in the wrapper, standard granola bar wrapper. Alright, so go ahead and open this. Alright, so, oh man, I just broke it. Alright, let me put this back together. Put this back together real quick, you know. Alright. Oh, this ain't going back together too well. Well, anyway. Oh, yeah, this thing's falling all apart. Man, this is pathetic. Alright, so this was half of one. So it kind of looks like it has the chocolate on top. I'm assuming that's uh, Thin Mint flavored chocolate. So let's go ahead and give us a little uh, gander. Oh, it seems falling apart all over the place. Are you kidding me? Alright, right off the bat, it has that granola bar taste, that texture. It definitely has that thin mint taste. You know what? It's really like it, it's really just it was like falling apart. Like, right? Hmm. You know what? What I like about it is it's not like a candy. It's not too sweet. The only real thin mint part of it is that chocolate that's drizzled on top. It's not like embedded into, it looks like there's like little chocolate chips. Yeah, there's a little bit of like uh, um, mint flavored chocolate chips and the chocolate on top. But other than that, it tastes like the standard granola bar. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's pretty pleasing, you know? It, it, don't, don't get me wrong, 
This isn't like a, a Thin Mint, you know, this isn't like a Girl Scout cookie, you know, this isn't a substitution by any means. I mean, uh, Girl Scout season, you really need to go to your local Walmart and uh, go ahead and uh, meet and greet with your local uh, Girl Scout troop and uh, pick up yourself a couple boxes of Samoas and some Thin Mints and uh, indulge in the real thing. But this is a good, uh, you know, hold you over till the Girl Scout seasons kick in. So definitely get these for like a snack. But if you're looking for like that, that satisfaction of eating a Girl Scout cookie, this isn't it. But you know what? It's pretty damn good. So... Uh, I really recommend that you give it a shot, throw it in your lunch, and uh, call it a day. So, alrighty, like always, you guys have a great, great afternoon and evening, and thank you for liking and subscribing.